Hi, I'm fashion stylist Trisha Cromwell, and today Cheap Chic is going to talk about one of my very favorite wardrobe pieces, denim. And what better boutique to come to than Izzy's Emporium in Andover? I mean, they have every silhouette, every wash, every fit. I'm so excited to show you. But first, let's meet the woman behind the magic, Jen. Hello. What is the theme behind everything in here and what is your hottest item? So we're a true denim boutique. What we do is we customize jeans for women. Amazing. Of all sizes, all ages. I actually can't wait to look at all of your styles, especially the new arrivals. Mm -hmm. So let's check them out now. Sounds good. Now ladies, I've compiled my top tips for shopping for denim. And I'll tell you why. Because denim shopping is a sport. It's no joke. My first tip, don't get discouraged. Keep trying. Even when you don't fit the first four pairs, keep trying them on because you know once you do find the pair you love, you feel like a million bucks. Tip number two, make sure you bring shoes with you when shopping for denim. As we know, sometimes we need a pant that'll fit when we're wearing flat shoes or a pant that will fit when we're wearing high heels. Also a huge thing when fall is here and we want to wear riding boots and tuck our jeans in. That means we need to look for a skinny style rather than a boot cut. Tip number three, go for the fit in the waist, the hip and the rise first. As long as this area fits you okay, you can then worry about the length because you know you can always get it tailored or again, alter your footwear. The rise is actually the distance from the top of the button to the inseam. Let's start with the low. And this is the shortest distance from the top to the inseam. This is great for more boyish figures or narrow because it actually sits a little bit lower on your hips. Next up is a mid-rise. This is actually my best friend. This is universally flattering for all body types and it also really helps to reduce the muffin top. Sometimes if you feel like you've got an overflow on the sides, it means your rise is too low. So go with a mid or a high rise to eliminate and smooth that out. Next up is the high rise. And again, the higher you go, the more slimmer and the more shaped you will be, the more smoother, and it will kind of just really help to give you that hourglass. And it's also a fun, trendy fit. If you tuck a shirt in, the higher that your waist is, the longer that your legs appear. So this is great for us petite girls. Also for ultimate comfort, which who doesn't want ultimate comfort? That's why we're wearing jeans. Go for a soft denim with a stretch, and this material makeup can easily be found on the inside label of the denim. Every pair has a wealth of information on them. It will typically tell you what the fit is, what the rise is, where it will hug your body, and where it will sit on your hips, where it will be relaxed. Let's talk about why we really love jeans. What do we do when we put on a pair of jeans in the fitting room? We turn around and check out the rear view because we want our booty to look great. That's why we love jeans. And very key is actually the size and placement of pockets. So keep in mind, if you're trying on a denim that has small pockets and they're set far apart, that actually could add a little volume, make your booty look a little bit bigger. If you need volume in the back, it's a great idea to go with that size pocket or something like this here with embellishment, thicker threads, buttons or flaps. This will also create shape and give you a little bit of volume. Now, if you've already got a little volume in the back that you're working with, the best way to lift and tuck is to choose a denim with the pockets that are slightly larger, closer together, and then also the lower they are, they'll give your booty a little lift in the back. Next tip is to also pay attention to the details as well as the pockets. If there's zippers or pockets at the hip, it's gonna make you a little bit wider. So this would actually be ideal for a narrow body type or a boyish figure to give you a little bit of volume. Again, if you're already working with the volume, go for a detail that's a little bit lower on the thigh, a little bit closer to the knee, and that'll actually help balance out the width of your hips. So to show you all of these looks on, we actually have three models here with us. Three different body types, three different fashion personalities, but we're excited to show you how they come together. Now, Cassandra is heading out tonight. So we definitely wanted to give her a sexy and chic look, and I really think we've done it. Especially with these jeans, turn around to show them the pockets. How fabulous is this? Some bling and some detail to really accent her figure and her waistline, and the same with the high-low hem of the shirt. This is extremely figure flattering, even where the sand blasting and the wearing hits her on her thighs. This boot cut is also the perfect length for her. She threw on a pair of heels, 
perfect length, perfect silhouette. This worked for her. I love it and she's ready to go out. And now representing for us petite ladies is Jen. We've actually put her in a mid-rise, bit of a darker wash, skinny jean. This really helps to elongate your legs. And make sure that your footwear is also working with your jeans. For an added bonus, I've given her a heel with a pointy toe that shows a little bit of the top of her foot. That works in coordination with the denim to even further visually elongate her legs. Now paired with this, it's been on active wear, but really chic cardigan that's actually hooded, if you will demonstrate for us. This is a great casual cool outfit for Jen. So we put Michelle in a mid-rise, dark wash, straight leg jean. The reason is because Michelle is on the taller side, this look I love here, paired with flats, the scarf, and of course this cozy sweater. Ultimate fall day outfit. Thank you ladies for modeling these great looks and thank you all for joining us. I've given you some shopping tips as well as a breakdown on rise and silhouette. So hopefully you're now inspired to go out and find your new favorite pair of jeans. I'm fashion stylist Trisha Cromwell. This has been another edition of Cheap Chic, and we took over Izzy's Emporium. And you can clearly see why they have been voted the best jeans in the North Shore for seven years in a row. Till next time.